XRP, Ripple Labs, a company that I met face to face last year in 2022 at a conference. And I saw a professionalism from the people working there at the boot. And I got to tell you, since then, I've been looking and, and exploring, holding some XRP. Uh, I don't really talk too much here in the channel, but I'm going to start to do it. I see some colleagues, friends of mine doing it. And I'm like, you know, anything to help crypto and go against all the SEC garbage, right? What's happening with XRP? Well, right now the SEC is losing the battles of classifying this as a security. And everybody's really excited for that because the price whoo, is looking really sexy. Now, there's some out of the world predictions, $10,000 for one XRP, $500 for one XRP. I get it, right? I mean, the community is super bullish and I get it. I appreciate that a lot. That's really good. Now, the tokenomics, 100 billion, the max price of XRP over $1, right now 50 cents. I'm going to tell you some of the news that are really bullish and I'm happy I hold XRP. Tell me in the comments if you have. Welcome aboard, guys. Look at the price. But look, this one this is the CEO of, you know, Ripple and uh, outside the United States. Nobody cares about what the SEC is doing using the Howey test to classify it. You know, XRP as a security it makes no sense. And this comes to show that there's more than the United States when it comes to crypto. And we are tired of this. Like, we're tired of, you know, them just stopping the innovation and growth because they cannot keep up with us, right? Uh, outside the United States, nobody cares. A banking law expert, you know, says that using the Howey test is not a legit way to determine whether XRP is a security or not. We have... You know, Morgan Stanley, ex-co-president, saying XRP is a bridge currency that solves a multi-trillion dollar problem. Ripple is a clear winning in a cross-border space. It's all about money transfers. And since I've been in crypto, I've been aware that XRP is excellent on this. And, you know, it's a token that's been uh, in crypto for years. It's not a new token. It's not a new company. And uh, obviously, there's a lot of feeling and veteran investors and people who know a lot about this cryptocurrency and i'm so happy to have you if you're watching uphold will not delist xrp before the court decision why are we talking well we know a lot of crypto exchanges like coinbase right don't offer xrp for trading what's going to happen to the price when they start putting it back up again uh let's go to the markets you can buy it on binance you can buy it on cuckoo you can buy it on bitstamp kraken and some of them but Where's Coinbase? In the United States, obviously that's not possible. Where's Gemini? Where's other different ones, right? That is exactly, and even Kraken, I believe, even though it shows there, last time I've used it, I believe I wasn't able to buy. Correct me if I'm wrong. But the point is, thus far, I think XRP will be a winner, obviously. I think a lot of people are really bullish in it. I hold, a, I mean, above a thousand XRP. I want to add more to my position. Um, if you recall, this is not the cheapest price we've been over the last, you know, the last couple of years. XRP so far in the bull run of 2021, over one dollar, even close to two dollars. And we're looking at 10 cents this is 2020 right when you know the pandemic and also the court decision when it comes to xrp so really this cryptocurrency has seen some major major retracements and all the way from here it has done about 1800 percent which is incredible and from that point all the way to right now about 415 percent meaning xrp from everything that we're seeing it's an amazing catalyst to show the SEC that they cannot stop us. Versus going to be XRP. If the SEC wins, which I'm sure it's not going to do it, it's going to implicate the entire cryptocurrency experience. So many other projects at risk of the SEC coming at them. But for the way I see it and other content creators, we're going to win this one. There's a bunch of lawyers on this case for XRP and crypto. Guys, I wouldn't be scared. But I'm going to be adding, tell me in the comments if you enjoy XRP content. So give it a like. That will tell me to make more of this and keep you updated with this one because there's a bunch of news. And I think it's going to be a good addition to my portfolio of content. We cover a lot of things here, news and much more. And I think XRP is one that 
it's been on my radar for a long time, but I think it's finally time to take a look at this. I I know, you know, I, I went to a conference called Consensus 2022. There's going to be a new one in a couple of days right now in Austin, Texas. And I saw the Ripple uh, boot and I talked to some of the people, you know, veterans working over 10 years on Ripple. And I was like, I have actually uh, <laughs> a cap, a Ripple cap there. And it was cool, you know, getting to know some of the long lasting projects that they've been for a while. Sad but true, affected by the SEC clause because of lack of regulation and they see something doing really well. Um, but I'm sure it's all going to pass. And regulation is going to be for crypto and the US dollar will go down and crypto will go up. Peace.